Hey, what's up everyone? Professor Wolverine here, and I've gotten some requests to discuss the products I use on my beard. So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to describe chronologically uh, what I use for my beard. The first thing I use is a uh, beard wash. So this is the uh, Bull, Bulldog Beard Wash. Um, I like the smell. I don't use it every day. I use it, I'd like to say twice a week, but you know, with the lockdown and everything, it's probably more like once. Now, after I do that, I use uh, some conditioner. So right now I'm using this uh, Argan Oil conditioner. Um, you know, I don't know much about conditioners. I don't know what's best, but it's supposed to be good. And that's the one that I got. So that's important for cleaning your beard and then uh, moisturizing it after. You know, it's like a hair, you want, you want it to be soft. Beards in particular get quite uh, wiry. Um, so it's important to you know, condition it, oil it, whatever. Now, do you need beard wash and conditioner? I don't know. Uh, if you have a very short beard, probably not. Um, if you have a longer beard, I need to wash it somehow. So I mean, you might as well do it with that. Okay, what's next? Okay, I don't exactly do the same thing every single day, but usually next would be some, uh, some beard jelly. So this is Bossman beard jelly. Uh, it's like a beard oil, except it's thicker. Um, so let me let me show you the uh, the consistency. So it looks like that. Okay, so it's like kind of gooey. Um, it it has the same function as a beard oil. It's supposed to be, it's supposed to basically hydrate your beard, and, uh, and if you get it down to your skin, it should keep your skin from getting dry. Um, so that's what I use it for. So it's basically to soften up your beard. Okay, next. Next I'll use uh, either a heat comb or a blow dryer. If I use both, which I sometimes do, I'll use the heat comb first usually. However, before you do that, I use heat protectant. So the, uh, heat, the heat comb especially, it, it's, it gets quite hot. So the heat protecting is used to protect your beard from the heat damage. That's what I do. And I'll use the heat comb or the blow dryer, or sometimes I'll use, I'll use the heat comb and then the blow dryer. That's really only if I'm trying to get it to look like fancy, you know? Um, so what I'll do is uh, after I apply the heat protectant, I'll just plug in the blow dryer, take a round brush, and I'll uh, straighten it out. Like, like this kind of motion. And, uh, and that, that's, how I, that's, that's how I do. Now, do you need these things? Well, again, it depends on your beard, depends on, on how long it is. If your beard is very short, if it's, you know, an inch or less, you certainly don't need a blow dryer. You probably, in that case, just need a, uh, a comb. Sorry, that's Ken comb. It has a uh, wide tooth side and a regular tooth side. And then you might want to use some beard balm if you want it to, like, you know, not lay, uh, to lie nice and flat. If you want to lie nice and flat on your face and if you want to do a bit of styling. But for my beard, the blow dryer really gives my beard a different shape. It adds a lot of volume. It adds a lot of length. Um, I think it makes it look much better. I don't like my beard at all when I haven't done anything to it when it's longer. Uh, shorter beards are much less maintenance. Like until you reach like, I don't know, maybe the inch and a half or two inch mark, you don't have to do too much. But once it gets past that, like right now, I just trimmed it actually. And uh, it's still like not, you know, still not low maintenance. Okay, so next usually I'll uh, apply some beard balm after I finish blow drying it. Um, and this will help style it, help uh, lock it into place. So I'll just take a little bit. So this is a, again, Bulldog beard balm. I think it smells nice. Um, the consistency is, uh, it's a buttery consistency. So it's like that. Um, as opposed to, there are some other beard balms more of a, uh, a waxy consistency. So I'll show you right here. So this is uh, another kind of beard balm. I'll include the links to these in the description. And that consistency is like this. See, it's like it's hard. It's like a wax. And then you have to uh, emulsify it in your hands to use it. Okay, but then what I do is I just, uh, my sides are the biggest problem area. Uh, the hair doesn't like to lie flat, so I apply a lot of it there, and then the front. Um, if I want to style the front, I'll uh, you know do something like this, some sort of emotion, whatever. You get the idea. I'll put some on my mustache, keep the hairs off my lip, or try to at least, and uh, and that's what I do. I might use the Ken comb to brush it out a little bit. 
Um, but usually, usually that's about it. And I, I don't touch it afterwards until late at night. Another product I have is this for bristle brush. Um, it's, you know, big, it's nice. You get nice broad strokes with it. Um, you can, you know, straighten up your beard a little bit with it also. I think, I, I like it. I don't use it all the time, but uh, I think it's definitely a useful product. Okay, now is that it? Not quite. So every night before I go to bed, so I always started doing this about a month ago. Before that, I didn't have a, night, my, a nighttime routine, maybe two months ago. Um, so what I do is after I eat dinner, I always eat a big dinner. I have like a day's worth of food in one sitting essentially. I eat for like two hours. Um, and then I get all this food all up in my beard. So like my mustache and here in particular, I get a lot of food in it. So what I do is I, I, I rinse it out. So I always, I basically rinse my beard twice a day, in the morning, in the shower, and then at night. So I'll rinse it out and I'll take this wide tooth comb after I rinse it and I'll and I'll and I'll try to uh, I'll fluff it out. So this will help untangle the beard and it'll also help to get any food residue that remains in your beard. Okay, and then after that I just I take some beard jelly and I and I just rub it in. And I uh, hope that this will be enough so that uh, when I wake up in the morning it won't be a total bird's nest. And that's basically what I do for my beard. Okay, so that was a lot of products. So let me just tell you my top three products that I would use if I could only use three. One, it would probably be beard balm. Two, it would probably be a round brush. And three, it would probably be a blow dryer. Those are exactly the products I need to style it. Okay, the trimmer I use is a Philips trimmer. I think it does the job. I was looking into buying a Brio beard skate recently, but they're all sold out. And last but not least, the mask. This is a beard mask. I highly recommend it. I'll include the links to all the products in the description and you can check them out. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. I will reply. Any subscriptions, likes, shares, I appreciate. I'm Professor Wolverine and I hope to see you next time.